Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, here's a fun fact. I've already covered over 3,000 different games. If you enjoy what you see, please hit that subscribe button and support me in continuing my work. Today, I want to showcase some exciting upcoming mobile games in 2023. Please note that the release dates may vary depending on your location, with some games launching earlier or later in different regions. Certain games will be available first on iPhone, while others will be released on Android. I'm really enthusiastic about the games I'll be showing you, so make sure to stick around and check them all out. Without further ado, let's jump into the first one. Call of Duty Warzone Mobile is ushering in the next era of Call of Duty franchise with the highest quality Battle Royale mobile game experience, featuring authentic Call of Duty, Warzone-style combat, weapons, movement, and vehicles. Tom Clancy's The Division Resurgence is a mobile installment of the TPP action game series The Division, developed and released by Ubisoft exclusively for Android and iOS devices. As in previous installments of the series, the focus is on tactical shooting, storyline, and acquiring increasingly powerful equipment. King Arthur Legends Rise. Explore a massive interactive world. Collect and upgrade legendary knights and warriors and fight fearsome medieval and mythical monsters in this epic fantasy. Arthurian-themed Action Squad RPG. Jade is a mobile installment of the Assassin's Creed series. The game takes us to ancient China and offers a large open world to explore. Players can create their own character for the first time in the brand's history. Devil May Cry. Peak of Combat inherits the Devil May Cry's free, flexible strategy skills and gorgeous, unconstrained fighting style. And at the same time, it also brings players an immersive combo experience with its industry-leading motion capture technology, which perfectly reproduces the most distinctive battles of Devil May Cry, make the experience more diverse. Final Fantasy VII Ever Crisis is a mobile game presenting events known from all games set in the FF7 universe, and offers a similar gameplay model to the mentioned title. The game was released in episodic form. Century Age of Ashes will be free to play multiplayer dragon battle game. Master a growing roster of classes and dragons, compete in intense arena battles and rule the skies in fast-paced aerial combats. Reckoning is a shooter MMO based on the movie license. The game offers single-player story missions, cooperative challenges, and PvP battles against other players. Warcraft Arclight Rumble strategy game set in the Warcraft universe. In Warcraft Arclight Rumble, our task is to defeat the boss and prevent the destruction of our base. To do this, we set units called Minis, which fight independently, gather resources, and take over objects. Ashfall, a post-apocalyptic MORPG shooter, developed by Legendary Star Studio. Ashfall is set in a world ruined by nuclear war. Your goal is clear. You must go on a quest to find the legendary core of creation, the key to saving humanity. Star Wars. Hunters is a free team-based game in which players compete on a limited arena, taking on the role of their favorite character from the Star Wars universe. Harry Potter Magic Awakened is an RPG card game with the license of the popular book series about the young wizard. The game is a sort of continuation of the original series of books and movies and allows you to learn magic and participate in PvE and PvP duels. Into the Dead 3 the third installment in the series of FPP Endless Runners, in which we fight for survival in a world overrun by the living dead. Naraka Blade Point is an online action game that refers to For Honor from Ubisoft. Just Cause Mobile Spin off of the popular Just Cause series, designed for mobile devices. 